Only News 3 is there for the re reunion between a prize pendant and its rightful owner. We shared last night UW students were robbed, laptops, money, and a phone all taken. Plus something priceless, the Star of David pendant that was in one student's family for generations. Only Leah Lynch, I caught up with him following this morning's surprising discovery. When an invaluable family heirloom was stolen from his house on North Henry Street, Martin Wise thought he'd never see it again. But just two days later, he's receiving a welcome surprise. I was sad, I felt violated, like sick to my stomach, you know, just like emotionally drained. 20-year-old Martin Weiss was at a loss after losing a Holocaust heirloom, generations old, stolen from his bedroom just a few days ago. This necklace has been passed down throughout our family's history, like I am entrusting this to you, like you need to do everything in your power to hold on to it, and then to have it, you know, like ripped away from me was just something that I couldn't believe it. Amazing. Unbelievable to Martin as well is what, what happened Friday morning. Thank you for finding the backpack, dude. Yeah. Fraternity yeah. president Jacob Levine was the first out of the house. I had an early test this morning and I always bike to class. The first thing I saw when I got to the bikes was a red backpack um, right against the wall. Along with electronics that had also been stolen from the household, Levine found so this is the backpack. The most valuable um, missing item. It was actually unzipped when I found it and the first thing I did was open it and then I go inside, I open up all the pockets wow. and there is Martin's necklace. Wow! Un Real. Reunited with his star for the first time. Unreal. Weiss is still in disbelief. I'm still like... <sighs> Still trying to fathom that I have it back in my possession. It's great. It's amazing. And after two days, without feeling the weight of the star around his neck, you can bet he so. won't be so taking it off. It's going to go right here. Anytime soon. It's going to stay that way for quite some time. Madison police are still investigating this case as a burglary and are reviewing last night's security tapes. But Martin says he's so grateful to have his star back, he likely won't press charges. In Madison, Leah Lynchide for WISC News 3. We like those happy yeah, endings, great don't we? Great ending to that one, you bet.